Hello, hi guys. Uh, it's me again. We are going to uh, look at uh, Metamatrix N4. So today I'm going to show you uh, under a uh, determinant uh, Krasma rule. We're we'll going to show you how to determine a minor and a core factor. So uh, these two are uh, they are a bit uh, more likely are the same, but uh, they are uh, confusing a uh, lot of students uh, how to uh, differentiate between a minor and a core factor. So uh, today, uh, let's look at our question. Let's say uh, write it down and evaluate uh, the minor of a negative five. So uh, then we are having uh, this. One. So our negative five uh, is this uh, number. So a uh, negative five uh, to find the minor of a negative five, we are going to uh, cancel all the number that are in line with uh, five. So vertically and horizontally. So we are left with a uh, three and uh, minus two and uh, minus three and one. So uh, that gives us um, mm, we are having a three, uh, three. Uh, sorry, three minus two minus uh, three and one. So uh, this is uh, the minor of a negative. Uh, five. So uh, this uh, the minor of negative five is my positive three minus uh, two minus uh, three then one. So uh, then we have uh, minus uh, three and then minus two is positive two positive three minus two minus three and then a uh, one. So this is the minor of a negative five. So to evaluate uh, the minor, we have to simplify. Uh, and the minor so we have to cross multiply then we multiply 3 multiplied uh, by uh, 1 is going to give us a uh, 3 minus then uh, minus 2 multiplied by minus a uh, 3 give us a uh, positive a uh, 6 then uh, this will be equals to a minus a uh, 3 so uh, this is the a uh, minor of a negative a uh, 5 so then if they say determine uh, write down and evaluate the minor of a negative 5 so uh, this one is the minor of a negative 5 after it's been uh, simplified but uh, this one is still correct this is the minor of a negative 5 so here we have evaluated at the minor so uh, then uh, to determine uh, the cofactor, okay, the next question is say uh, write it down and evaluate uh, the cofactor of uh, 6. So uh, for a cofactor, it's more of the same, but as in under the cofactor, we have uh, to show that uh, 6 is in the first row and the 6 is in the second column. So uh, this one is our uh, 6. We have to determine uh, the minor. Uh, the cofactor, sorry, the cofactor of uh, 6. So we have to uh, cancel all the number in line with uh, 6 horizontally and uh, vertically. Then we remain with uh, 4, 8, and then minus uh, 3, then 1. So, uh, but uh, to determine uh, this, uh, the cofactor of uh, 6, we have to show that uh, 6 is in the uh, first column. So that means it's minus 1 into. Uh, 6 is in the first row that is to the power 1 plus uh, 6 is in uh, the second uh, column uh, second column that means it's plus uh, 2 then uh, the minor of uh, 6 is a uh, 4 8 minus a uh, 3 and 1 so uh, this is a uh, the cofactor of a uh, six. So to evaluate uh, the cofactor, we have to simplify. So this one is give us a uh, three. That means minus one uh, to the power of three is give us minus uh, one. And so then we we'll cross multiply uh, my one multiplied uh, by uh, four is give us a uh, four minus and then a uh, minus eight minus three multiplied uh, by eight it give us a negative a 24 so then uh, to simplify it here yeah, we're going to uh, sign uh, this one is equals to uh, minus a 28 so here yeah, is a minus times a minus give us positive then it give us a 28 
then times and this negative one and the other side is give us negative 28 so uh, this negative uh, 25 is our uh, core of factor so to determine uh, the core factor we have to show that the, the number that we are uh, referring uh, to is in which uh, column so uh, then uh, say determine the core factor of a uh, six six is in the, uh, the first uh, row then it's uh, to the power of one plus and six is in the uh, second uh, column with the plus uh, two so this is how we determine a, a core factor but a minor we only uh, take uh, this uh, number inside this uh, two uh, lines so if we say determine the minor of a uh, six this is the minor of six but if we include that uh, six is in the first row uh, and is in uh, the second uh, column so this is give us uh, the core factor of a uh, six so uh i hope uh, you find uh, this uh, information uh, useful guys so watch up my next video where we're going to uh, discuss about our uh, discuss about the complex and numbers cheers